If you guys are looking for super cheap and reliable coins, look no further than my sponsor, MuttReserve.com. They're awesome to work with. They got 24-7 support. Guys, don't waste your money on packs. Hit up the sponsor. Use code Poodle at checkout for 15% off of your entire order. What's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. We got Madden 21, video 2 of the day, guys. We have our pack opening in the books. I'm not going to say watch it now, but when you are done, go check that out, guys. We have one of the greatest pack openings I've at least ever had, especially day one, guys. 87s, 86s crazy crazy packs guys you don't even understand for me who don't i'm gonna buy packs this year guys so you guys keep supporting the channel you show some love we're gonna keep buying packs check out the poodle merch guys we got it rocking here as you guys can see super hyped to have it for the vids now of course but guys let's get into this what everyone wants to know what to do first in madden 21 the question everyone's gonna be asking before we get into it guys make sure to subscribe to the channel turn on the noti boys if you want to see great videos all year great content and watch us just come onto the scene as fast as possible make sure to sub and turn that bell and guys can you guys like the video that's all i ask of you guys that's all i ask in return helps with the channel a lot if you're loyal always hit that like button but let's get into this everyone's wondering what do you do day one of the game and so on and so forth for day one of you getting the game first thing you want to do guys when you hop on the game it's going to make you play these rival solos get those done that's how you unlock your team captain now once you unlock your team captain you go right over here to pick your captain and you go ahead and you go over here so tryouts you're gonna have to go ahead and play all four of these solos i believe and when you do it's gonna give you packs of where you can choose the captain you want now the thing with captains is eddie george leroy glover ed mccaffrey and es williams like i told you guys if you guys don't know who you want i have a video up on the channel go check it out i rank all four of them told you reasoning behind why now you don't have to follow my rankings my number four guy i gave reasoning for even why he could have went higher so if you guys like the reasoning go ahead and make him your number one all i do is just incite you guys go check them out me personally if i had to tell you guys who i want you guys gotta watch the video. I went so in depth there. Go over there, it'll make a lot more sense to you. But I'm gonna have to do the tryouts, of course. Make sure I like them out. But we got a running back, a defensive tackle, a wide receiver, and a cornerback. Make the right decision for you. Once you do that and you're into the game more properly and you're ready to go, two routes to take. Are you a money spender? If so, go pop a pack, baby, guys. I did a fire pack opening. Love the results of it. But if you're not a money spender, we we, we go left. We go to the left now. We gotta get some stuff done. So you wanna unlock your Mutt Master. The way you unlock your Mutt Master is getting a touchdown in a solo challenge. So go ahead, go to a solo challenge, get your Mutt Master done. Why get it done now? Because you want to have him in your team because the things that he does, does lead to you completing activities that will upgrade him. So if you don't have him yet, it's going to kind of hinder your ability to upgrade him. In my personal opinion, I want every game to count towards him. So you want three, you're going to need three multiplayer wins. Pretty much, guys, if you don't know how this works, their overall goes up based on things you do. So second you get three multiplayer wins, his overall is going to get a, a token that you can upgrade him with. 100 stars and challenges, 100 games with an 82 team, so on and so forth, all the way up to some crazy objectives that is going to take a while, but that's why he's not supposed to be 93 day one. I'll make a video going over the fast way to finish him at a later date, guys. Obviously, today is not the day for that because not many people even have the game yet. Then you have Mutt Master uh, Series 1. The things you want to do with your Mutt Master, you want a 45 team sacks, 70 team sacks, 75 tackles with Sam Mills, 150 tackles with Sam Mills. Guys, go ahead. Go get your touchdown now. Come back out, toss him in your lineup so you can go ahead and tackle people and play around with him because until you do that, you're not going to be able to upgrade him during the first series. So you're going to want to get these done, guys. So do all that. Next, we, of course, have Mutt Dedication. Guys, you want to be focusing on these, the weekly missions. So weekly missions. You get these done during the week, and you do get rewards. So 2,000 coins, uh, 10 series trophies, which is kind of important, series trophies. Simple stuff. Win 20 games. So simple. Play your solos. The three daily missions. So simple. Just log on for three days and do the stuff. 1,500 yards, super simple. That is solo battles. That's up to you. 10 head to head games is simple. And weekend league is simple. The only thing that might be a little bit hard is squad. If you don't have a squad, make sure you're getting those done. Check your daily missions. Win two games, purchase a pack. You got a daily quick sell pack. Could be a banger. Daily engagement. Make sure you're doing these every day because as you get later in the year, it does add up. You get power up passes for doing these daily. So if you don't, you my recommendation, if you're not going to play for the day, that's okay. Just log on, do your thing. Because when we get to like these days, you get like 97 overall power passes, 96, and they're super useful, super uh, efficient in terms of saving coins. And a lot of people don't log on to do this. Then you want to get your mutt level up. Your mutt level is how you do unlock rewards, how you go ahead and you get your Andre Johnson up in uh, overall. So level five, you get a player pack, you get coins, mutt master tokens, upgrade your Andre Johnson, level master, sorry. You get, uh, of course, you get training, you get a power pass, and so on and so forth. It just keeps going all the way up. And guys, want to look at these levels? Very simple. Log on there and go check it out. But for the most part, you get power passes, coins, packs, all the way up to the banger level of level 50, which is an 87 to 80 overall power pass. And usually there's a good store option like a uh, legend pack or something along those lines. So super excited for that. 
and just make sure you're leveling up guys you want to get your level up as soon as possible but if you have the EA access trial I wouldn't focus on levels yet because you're gonna run out of time definitely focus on getting some of your objectives done that you can do this week and then career stats is just an overall thing to look at and this is important too if you're an online guy make sure you complete this every single series uh 200 wins sounds like a lot but these trophies is enough to pretty much get your free series master which shouldn't be in the store just yet but i will check it out for you guys in case it is special offers we have a starter pack right here uh 22 gold two elites well, that's pretty cool might actually have to open that but open that at a later date now moving on a little bit further these are the playbooks and competitive right here so the series master is not up yet but eventually he will be hopefully if we have one of those again and you can use your trophies on them and these are some of the packs guys if you're opening packs this is where you want to come to if you're not opening packs then you may just want to wait in terms of that um in if you got an open packs the game changers actually look pretty solid to be completely honest with you guys not a bad bundle at all to be honest with you guys with a topper of 85 plus and then 87 plus 43 percent and if we go to a regular pack 86 plus kind of rare not gonna lie it's kind of rare but you have a really good chance of elites per pack so it's not too bad at all but beyond all that guys if you're not a money spender let's move back up let's get back on the uh on the wagon here what you want to do next in my opinion once you look at your objectives and you kind of have an understanding because that's what you want to do you want to know your objectives first so you can go t while you play understand what you got to do because the thing is some people don't know so they're not going for tackles with mills they're not going for fumbles and stuff you want to know then you got to go to these ea play challenges you get an elite 80 plus nat for 45 stars definitely go get this done guys it's a free elite player there's just so many free elite players you can be getting make sure you go ahead and take advantage of that and just get that done very simple and then you can get the go the extra mile get the extra stars get the training as well and then moving on guys once you're done with these challenges and you get leveled up a little bit higher you should unlock more challenges which you're going to want to get done there's going to of course be you want to do the nfl epics the nfl epics get you five free players there is jerry uh ooh, ronnie lott larry fitzgerald jack youngblood adrian peterson and one other guy that's really just slipping my mind right now you want to get that done guys as soon as possible do not forget to go ahead and do that and then you want to take a look at sets as well guys this is what we're working with right now team captain exchange if you don't like your team captain come over here uh core rookie exchange guys one good tip if you get rookies i would be on the lookout on the auction block sniping out rookie cards if you can because there's a rookie master isaiah simmons and he's probably the greatest card in madden right now so you want to go ahead and get as many rookies as you can so go snipe out some rookies see if you can finesse them off the block if you pull any see if they sell for a lot of money if not hold on to them but that isaiah simmons is going to be a problem you definitely want to go ahead and do that and then of course you have the regular player exchange exchanges as per usual to get higher overall players now beyond that guys there's gonna be more solos unlocking there may be a journey there may be a gauntlet get your solos done now again if you're on the trial be wary pick the right one for yourself and don't forget to also do the nfl uh rivals one that i showed you guys right here when you finish this one which i want to touch on you do get another uh, free player here at the end you get a pack which is going to give you i believe three free players you get to pick one all the way somewhere down here you get a bunch of nap packs first off you definitely want to take that and you're able to upgrade them with these boost tokens all the way up to i believe an 85 overall it's 85 i believe 85 or 83 85 so you get, get these packs of course they could be pretty good players and then when you take the the other ones there's gonna be a jalen smith ben roethlisberger or a zach Ertz. i personally like jalen smith but i did do a ranking video same one as the team captain go check that out and guys that pretty much wraps up all the things you really want to be doing get your team captain go through the solos look at your objectives make sure you're doing the right stuff do not waste your 10 hour time like you want to be efficiently using that so you can do it properly in my case i'm trying to make videos in your case make sure you're getting done the best stuff first and do not buy cards off the block go ahead get all your free players first get your epics get your rivals get your nat players get your pre-order stuff make sure you build a team first and then go see what you need that's left for your child your team because guys you do not want to overspend on players right now or underspend you really don't know the value and then get screwed at the end when you go ahead and realize you got a bunch of free players you got to sell them back the value may not be the same just be careful guys but that's about it for the video hope you guys did enjoy if you're new to the channel smash that subscribe button turn that on about boys come join the family give this video a big thumbs up guys can we get over 300 likes in this video like i said if any video today hits over 500 likes i will do a bundle for you guys tomorrow or tonight depending but guys i'll keep ripping bundles as you guys hit so keep liking if you're loyal if you made it this far guys just like the video it helps out a lot and don't forget to sub you're not gonna want to miss out this year of madden content but guys that's about it enjoy the rest of your day it's been real i'm out peace